So uh, the craziest settlement ever, I think, just happened in my life. Yes. Ever being in the title business is we had a uh, seller come in for settlement and she disappeared into the bathroom for mm -hmm. like 20 minutes. Then she comes out and says that she doesn't feel safe in our building because her boyfriend's here and we need to ask her boyfriend to leave. Yeah, that was pretty crazy. And so he, he got pretty upset. <laughs> he was very upset. We had to escort him down to the lobby and ask him to leave the building. Apparently, the seller was afraid that once she closed, that he was going to go take her check and go cash it and spend it. So we ended up um, 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 following what her instructions were. And then later on, she asked us to call the police because she's afraid to walk out of the building with a check. Well, because he, he didn't leave. He waited outside across the street. And when we asked her, we said, what would you like us to do? She said, I want you to call the police. So I said, okay. So we called the police and the police showed up. And we watched him outside, talked to the guy. And a cop comes up, talks to me, comes into my office. And he's like, well... We've got a problem here, Mr. Green. I was like, what's that? He goes, she's got a warrant out for arrest, so we're going to be arresting her today, not her boyfriend. Uh, he's okay, and um, but we, we can't arrest her normally. We have to call the crisis department and have a special police officer come out just to arrest her. And so he takes her in the conference room, and he asks her, what were your plans today? And she was like, I'm going to take the check and take it to the bank and cash it. And Who's it, cashing it, a $240,000 check first? Of all? <laughs> like, you're going to think you're going to go to the bank and get a check for 240 grand? Uh, Man, I thought she was. I, I stood. And then, so uh, then the cop comes in and he's like, they got her in handcuffs. So not only did she want her boyfriend kicked out, she told us to call the cops. She's the one who got arrested, and a cop mm -hmm. walks out and hands me her check. And she, says, she won't be needing this where she she's definitely going. would not be needing this where she was going. <laughs> so that was my craziest. What's yours? Um, uh, I mean, I definitely can't beat that, you know. But let's see some of the craziest settlements that I've been in. Um, I mean, we had closings where um the two spouse uh, the spouses were in oh, those are arguments ones. on who is getting how much and um you know we had uh, these sellers sitting in the conference room for probably hours until finally we told them look you know you guys will have to leave that way we'll hold the money in escrow for you while you guys contact your own divorce attorney to figure out who's getting what before we can disperse the funds oh I, that reminds me in our old <laughs> office i remember I had a divorced couple, yes. and they both showed up with their new boyfriend and girlfriend <laughs> at settlement. And the guy was like 6'5", 300 pounds in the military, uh -huh. and she had some young guy with him. And he was so upset that we had to take him and split him off into two separate yeah. Uh, conference rooms, mm -hmm. but they wouldn't sign anything until the other one was signed. And I'm like, what who's going to go do? first? Who's going to go first? <laughs> and that was another crazy one. Well, I'm not, yeah. I want the originals. I don't want her to have the original. I was like, dude, come on. I'm going to keep the originals. Correct. And you guys both get copies. How about that? <laughs> and they still settle. Yeah, I mean, we always do end up making everything work, you know, so I'm glad even with the lady that got arrested. She came, she came by came the other day and, and picked, picked up, up her check, so they yeah. let her out of jail. I'm surprised that was it good was news for her. Quick. Yeah, good yeah. for her. Now she can go cash her $240,000 check. <laughs> so we thought that would be a good title story for you guys for some of the craziest settlements. We'll probably have some more come up with some other people beside me and men. All right. Well, I just got to uh, add on. Okay. These are very limited amount of crazy settlements. This Most isn't our normal clientele. All very smooth. Okay. <laughs> we don't want to scare anybody <laughs> off here. But if you do have a crazy buyer or seller, we do specialize in that. Oh, yeah. We are professional on that. <laughs> have a good one, guys. Take care.